Hi, I'm Stephen with MikeReynolds.com, and today we're talking about one of our very popular microphone rentals, the AKG C414. Now, we're specifically talking about the AKG C414 XLS, but throughout the blog, I'm actually going to be referring to this as the 414 or even the 414. The AKG C414 was one of the first large diaphragm condensers that I ever got to use and record on. Now, I mentioned the 414 in one of my blogs all the way back at the beginning, uh, and it's called the Core 4. Check that out when you get a chance. Um, the 414 can be found in every recording studio that takes itself seriously. Now, because of its rugged build, uh, the 414 not only is seen in studios, but also it can be seen on the stage for you know live events. It's considered by many to be the industry standard by which all other condenser mics are compared to. Now, for starters, the 414 is, like I mentioned, a large diaphragm condenser. It has a full frequency range and is capable of doing nine pickup patterns. I'll explain that later. Uh, it can also handle sound pressure levels of up to 158 dB uh, just by pressing these uh, four attenuation pads on the back of the mic. Um, this makes the 414 a great microphone rental for just about anything. Some of the applications that our customers use include mic and guitar amps, both live and in studio, as well as acoustic guitars, drum overheads, um, audience mics, even background or group vocals. Now, I want to mention that the C414 XL2 is a better microphone for recording lead vocals uh, in the studio. That's due to a presence peak that is a little bump in the high frequency range of the response chart. Now, let's talk about these pickup patterns for a second. The C414 is capable of doing nine pickup patterns. Now, the mic itself is labeled for an omni pickup pattern, wide cardioid, cardioid, and hypercardioid, and finally, bidirectional. Now, electronically, it also does intermediate pickup patterns between omni and wide cardioid, wide cardioid and cardioid, cardioid and hypercardioid, and finally, hypercardioid and bidirectional. The reason for this is that pickup patterns can be frequently independent from one another. Pickup patterns usually do not remain true to their form per given frequency. And the electronics of the 414 allow you to blend between some of the more standard pickup patterns. Not every pickup pattern is perfect for each application, so you'll want to experiment with each pickup pattern so you can get the desired end result. Now keep in mind to use the attenuation pad when miking instruments such as kick drums or guitar amps in order to prevent peaking. Now this mic has a peak hold red LED that will come on for about three seconds if peaking does occur. Then you can make your adjustment on the uh, attenuation pad on the back right side of the mic. Uh, you can also use the four position cut filter right here on the left side uh, to reduce the proximity effect um, at both 40, 60, 80, and 160 hertz. Now, at when you rent the AKG C414 XLS, it comes with a pop filter, a windscreen, and a shock mount. You can also rent a pair of 414s for room, audience, or overhead recording, and save about 25 bucks on your order. Well, that wraps it up for the AKG C414 XLS. Thanks for watching. I'm Steven with MikeReynolds.com. Mm -hmm.